people, they stand behind her. The show of support comes after students learned the girl's senior portrait was omitted from the yearbook because she wore a tuxedo. Her picture shouldn't be uh, t taken off from our yearbook because, you know, it's who she is. You can't, we can't deny that. She can't deny that. We don't have a right to de deny that. Principal Gary Cannon says while he's proud of his students for speaking out, he says the school's senior portrait dress policy is very clear. For males, it's a, a tuxedo, a shirt and tie and coat. And for females, it's called a drape. And that's what it has been. But in a statement released this afternoon, the school says, quote, these events have sparked a campus-wide dialogue, which will result in a revision of policy. While it's unclear what that revision may be, students hope it's one that allows kids to be themselves even in their senior picture. They teach us in the Catholic school to be, you know, who we are, to accept everybody. So that's what we're doing. We're just practicing what they preach to us. And Jessica tells me that she has never felt more loved than right now. She said she did have a meeting scheduled with the school today, but again today the school uh, announcing that they will make changes to their senior portrait dress policy because of how the students have reacted. Reporting live in San Francisco, I'm Jody Hernandez, NBC Bay Area News. Jody, thank you. We also have some relief now for students.